No, and we've got one last pearl from the pearl up, <laughs> which I nearly forgot about. Yeah, I know. Oh, mate, I've got an interview with the brickies. <laughs> you already come in. So, handicapped to wait for age, or wait for age to handicap. Um, the, the, the plus is handicapped to wait for age. Now, I know that often you get horses suited by um, a fast pace that won't get the same pace in the wait for age race, but what the handicap does is it's a competitive race. Mm. Everyone's, everyone's trying. Yeah. In the handicap, it's a competitive race which produces better form. Like, you you're right. much stronger for it. So yeah. when you see Happy Clapper coming from 50 to 57, disregard? Disregard, because like he's come from he's the, up. he's come from the U-Butte race. Yes. No, he come from a fight. Yeah, yeah that's he right. came from a fight. Yeah. So he's had a fight, everyone else has been sparring, now he's going with the sparrers. Yeah. Don't mm. worry about going up weight, not that we care way about weight anymore. You know, I thought Chautauqua was such a plain run in the new market, but I realised that the other, the other thing underlining that is intent. Like, they're actually not that serious about the new market because they don't perceive him to be that well suited. Yeah. This is the connections, right? And then they go into the wait for age race and they go, well, it's our day today, boys. There it is. So, but the other converse, wait for age to handicap, is you've been running in done races. You've been, run, you've been running in cheesy races. Now, I know, I know that Wink's won, but um, the exception can prove the rule. She's as good an as we've seen some Yeah, and you know, obviously there are you know, horses that are being hidden away in weight for age races, but your general weight for age form doesn't translate that well to handicaps. There it is. What a great pull.